Welcome to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Amber here with a titanium farming run. We're marking titanium here with our raven right now. We are in Lincoln. I'll show you the map in a minute, but first want to get through the beginning of this run. So here you'll be able to find titanium as well as assassinate enemies to get XP along the way. So here is our first titanium node. Each of the nodes is worth four titanium. And there are five such nodes here in Lincoln. So you can get 20 titanium here alone. And we'll also be going to a couple other spots. And here is the first pair of enemies that we can stealth assassinate. And as you see in the upper right corner, that was worth 75 XP. I got the 50% stealth bonus and another 75 XP, so a very quick 150 XP. And there are more guards to the right that you can stealth kill, but I'm only killing the ones that are on the way to the titanium right now. And here is the second titanium node near this fireplace near the well. So I'm going to collect that. There are a couple guards up here under the arch, but I'm not going to kill them because it takes a little bit longer since there's a third guard in the way. But if you really want the XP, you can kill them as well. But I'm going to head up towards the third titanium node. I'm going to go through this archway with the Roman statues to both sides. And it's not in this building, but the second building up ahead the one with the gap in the wall, which I'm going to jump over right here. And then the titanium is in a room to the left through this doorway. And there it is, our third titanium node. And then the fourth titanium node is just to the left up this hill, but before I grab that, I'm going to kill these two guards. And these are easier to kill than the other ones, so I'm going to quickly come over here and stealth assassinate the first one. But I got detected by the second one, and rather than do the chain assassination, I'm going to use the feign death skill so I can assassinate the second guard as well for the full 75 each, 75 XP for each of them. And then I'm gonna head back into the city and up the hill, going for our fourth of five titanium. And this one is near the tavern where you can also drink mead. It's near the fireplace here near the table. I forgot to mark that one on the map because you can only mark three and this is the fourth. And then the fifth is right there at the end of the wall. So I'm going to head over towards that one now. And on my way, I'm going to kill two more pairs of guards. Here's the first pair, and again I'm going to stealth kill the first and then use the feign death melee ability so I can stealth assassinate the second. Trying to avoid outright combat just because that takes a little bit longer. And then here is the fourth and final pair of guards gonna sneak up from behind them, <laughs> stealth assassinate the first, and then feign death, and stealth kill the other one. And there are two more pairs of guards inside this courtyard, but I'm not going to kill them right now because this run is mainly interested in titanium, but I'm just killing the guards that I pass along the way. So the last titanium node here in Lincoln is on the wall. 
And the other reason I kill the guards is if you just go and grab all the titanium really quickly, you have to wait longer before coming back here again because it takes five or six minutes for the titanium to respawn. So rather than killing time, gathering other materials, I just rather take a little extra time to get some XP while I'm here. And here is the last titanium node in Lincoln. And there's a chest there to Eivor's left, which I've already opened. And now we're going to go to two more high points here in Lincolnshire. So we're going to make a little triangle. We're going to go up to that one, the second one, and then come back here again. So now we're going up to the high point called Lace Stone. And the reason I picked this one is because there's a titanium node right near where Eivor spawns. There it is. <laughs> Super fast to collect titanium at this high point. And then the high point to the east of it right here, the titanium node is also pretty close, not that close. But it is in a cave basically below the high point. So you can find it with your raven, but it's a little tricky because it's actually below the high point. So after you do the leap of faith, you head backwards in the opposite direction and go around and into this cave. And there'll be a titanium node in here. And there it is. But after collecting it, before returning back to our starting point, you'll need to save and reload your game. This helps ensure that the titanium nodes in Lincoln will respawn. So if you get back to Lincoln and the titanium hasn't respawned, then you might need to come back here or to another high point outside the region, save and reload and try again. But don't worry, eventually the titanium will respawn. And we're not even at the eight minute mark and already we've collected 28 titanium and 600 XP. So if we do this four times, it'll take about half an hour and we'll have over a hundred titanium and 2,400 XP. And if you want more, you can keep on going because this is a continuous run. You can keep repeating. So here we are back where we started at Lincoln Harbor, and you will see that the titanium has respawned. And there it is. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider subscribing to my channel. This is Amber. I'll see you in the next one with more guides and gameplay for Assassin's Creed Valhalla.